tips to choosing your agent part two this part will help you with things to look for and avoid when you are choosing your agent one of the main things to avoid is unsubstantiated market research and evidence it is very easy for an agent to throw figures at you to impress you and try and pull you on board but to do this and provide a figure an evaluation will need to take place as well as a viewing of the property Typically, an analysis of a quarter mile radius will take place from your property. This will look into homes that have been sold in the last 12 to 28 months that fit a similar criteria to the property that you are providing. Doing this allows for an accurate idea of the market around you and the things that people are buying at what prices. This is then tailored to fit you and make sure that you are getting the offers that the property deserves. Having a property marketed at the wrong price will bring a lot of problems over to you in both undervaluing and overvaluing. Overvalued properties will sit on the market for extended periods of time and including on things like Zoopla, on the market and right move. When they have been on there for a longer period of time, they begin to move down the list. As they are further down the list showing on the websites, they are going to be less likely to get more inquiries and they are going to go silent. In comparison, undervalued properties will get a lot of inquiries, but they will be lower than the property is worth. This means that although you are getting lots of inquiries and you are feeling movement, you are potentially losing thousands of pounds on your property.